Hi. Today I am going to talk about Hacker Rank. What is Hacker Rank? Hacker Rank is a platform where you want to improve your skills by solving the problems. Okay. This is for students and IT people who want to learn more about technology. And if they want to improve any programming skills. This will help us to crack your interviews and it will help for real-time project is its purpose. At the same time, you can learn new skills and enhance your analytical skills as well as programming skills by solving the problems. See here, skills speak louder than words. Actually, I love this quote. As a student or an IT person, you should be perfect in any one of the skill. If you click on this for developers, here you can see prepare by topics. These are the topics where you want to enhance or improve your skill. Suppose I want to improve my skill in Java. Okay, just to go here. So these are the challenges. These are the problems which hacker rank is given. So we have to practice one by one. At the same time, I want to learn Python the same way. You can go to Python and you can give your answers here. And the same way you can practice for C, C++, or SQL, or Linux, or any functional programming. Okay, suppose I want to learn or I want to improve my skills in SQL, just click on this solve challenge. Okay, we need to sign up for this one. Just close this checkbox. Okay. Here, you need to select the database. So based on the questions, based on the questions, you need to provide your answer and you have to click on run code and you have to submit the code. You have to submit the code. So this way, this way we will get more confidence on the technology. So whatever the technology we are going to learn. And also, this is the platform where you want to get the certifications freely by solving the problems. Okay, see here, Node.js, Java Basics, React, SQL, Basics, SQL Intermediate, and SQL Advanced. Okay. And these are the competitions. So these are the previous competitions. Okay, it has been done in 2021. So if you want to participate in this competition, so you can participate it. This is about Hacker Rank platform. So before going to participate or before going to prepare or before going to submit your answers to the problem, we need to sign up. What you can do, just to go to Google, just to go to Google, and type hacker rank. Type hacker rank. The very first link. Just click on this one. This is the option. Sign up. Just click on here. Here, you can select. I'm here to practice and prepare. Solve the problems and learn new skills. Okay. Just click on this one. And click on create account. Click on create account. So here you need to provide your first name and last name and email and password. I'm giving my channel name here. Create a talks, email ID, wait is cool, 92. This is my email ID. So here you can set to a password. 
and click on this checkbox and create an account create an account okay these are the three parameters you need to provide okay so these are the basic steps just you have to fill it you can select based on your option suppose if you are a student or a fresher okay learn and compete with others or else if you want to prepare for job interviews just click on this one i am going to click learn and compete with others and you are a student or working professional so based on this option just you can choose this i have been a professional developer for so here you need to mention your experience two year or three years or four years something like that okay just click on let's go click on this not now so this way this way it will create an account for you okay it will create an account for you i want to practice i want to practice python suppose i want to practice python i want to practice the concept for suppose loops click on solve challenge click on solve challenge click on python 3 here python 3 so based on the task okay so based on the task you need to provide the code here and you have to click on run code and you have to submit the code okay so what is the problem here the provide code stub reads an integer and from std input okay so it will read the input from here and negative integers okay for example if you give 3 you need to display the squares of the numbers 0 1 square 1 2 square 4 3 square something like this for i in range of n okay for i in range of n it will read the loop i into i here okay i into i just run the code just run the code see congratulations congratulations so you have passed the sam sample test cases okay what are the test cases they have mentioned so it is completed now we can submit the code now we can submit the code see if you observe here all the test cases are passed all the test cases are passed so this way we can practice this way you can practice the skill which skill you want to practice either mathematics or algorithms or java or sql okay i'll show you one example for sql also click on this one and select the server here so which server you want to practice okay there is a database okay these are the databases db2 database or mysql or rkl or ms sql server i'm going to select this mysql server so this is the table guys city is the table these are the fields id name country code district and population these are the data types the query query all columns for an american city in the city table with the population larger than 1 lakh the country code for america is usa so for this one first what we need to do select star from table what is the table name city okay what are the conditions they have mentioned first condition is country code correct where country code equal to usa next with the populations larger than one lakh okay there is a column population okay and 
population larger than 1 lakh 3 to 5 okay now just run this code just run this code see the sample test cases are paused now we can now we can submit the code now we can submit the code so this way this way you will get the more confident this way you will get the more confident okay thanks for watching this video we'll meet you in the next topic first i'm going to create a playlist for sql sql we'll meet you in the next session happy learning